Welcome to Cadence Point YC's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature of Illustrator Technique in just a couple of minutes. In this video, I want to show you how to split a database model to solve a very common problem. I have in front of you a very simple case with two models, in particular two cylinders, and what I would like to do today is to assemble these two models into a single one. If I select my two models and I click on the Assemble Models option on the toolbar, I can see that in these this operation fails, the two models cannot be assembled into a single one. So what is going on? If I zoom in a little bit closer, it is pretty obvious in this case that these two cylinders are indeed overlapping. You can see the two colors mixing in there, which is a clear indication of an overlap. I want to show you today a way to resolve this problem. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to trim off a small section of the blue model create a clear connection between the blue and the red models, and then I'm going to be able to assemble them. So let's go ahead and do that. First thing I'm going to do is to create an appropriate curve in here to be able to perform this trim operation. So I'm going to select the boundary of this cylinder right there, and I'm going to go to create offset, specify an offset distance of zero, and click OK. What is going to happen in this case is that a new curve is going to be created where that boundary is located, and that is the curve that you see right there. Now let's go ahead and switch to layer 2 here, and I have my blue cylinder, that database model, and the new curve that I have created. So the next step in this process is to select this curve and to project it onto the blue model. So edit project and I'm going to select the blue cylinder as my target database. Project all the points got projected and click OK. At this point that curve is projected onto the blue cylinder so I'm simply going to select the blue model, edit, trim by curves and you can see that the curve that has been projected is now rendered in that color green, indicating that it can be selected, imprint, and as you can see very clearly right there, I have now I have split off that section. Let's click OK. Even though that section is split off, it's still part of the actual blue model. So the next step in this process is to select the blue model and go to Edit, split. We're going to split off that small section from the model. Select that section and click split. At this point I can grab this little section and perhaps move it to a different layer so I can actually get it out of the way. Let's bring the two models back together now that the blue one is split off. Click on the assemble models option again and as you can see, now the two models are assembled into one. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, drop us a line down below or connect with us on LinkedIn, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.